What's up, everyone? Good morning. Happy Wednesday from the lake. Sun is up, reflecting on the water. Bunch of the geese are still sleeping. It's uh, about 39 degrees. Good morning. We're over here. There's a, someone else over here riding. And uh, yeah, it's a beautiful morning. It's a beautiful morning. Halfway through the week. Uh, at the apex of the week. And um, we're back here at the lake. Beautiful day for a ride. Getting close to the end of the year. Getting close to Christmas. And uh, all good stuff. All good stuff. So we'll talk to you about, let's see, message of the day. About what if. What if. Um a lot of us bring what if into every conversation in our life. Um, you know, I'd like to get a new job, but what if it doesn't work out? I'd like to start a new business, but what if it doesn't work out? I'd like to um, do something in my life, but what if it doesn't work out? And we need to take that what if and swing it back to what if it does work out? What if it does get better? Um, we limit ourselves, the uh, limiting beliefs that we all carry around, uh, super common. Um, more and more people I talk to all talk about what if something can go wrong. But we need to talk about what if something can go right. Like my cone head hat today, huh? Um, we all self-doubt. Um, seems like very, very common. We all look for the reason why it's not going to work instead of the reason why it will work. Um, it's really just your mindset. Uh, this is a little Joel Osteen this morning. And, um, he basically says, God hands us a ticket and it's up to us to take it. Um, what you need is there. If you want it, um, are you going to take it? Are you going to take it? That ticket, the ticket you need to do whatever it is you need to do, the talent you need, the strength you need, the opportunity you need is all there in front of you. If you're willing to take it. Instead of saying, what if it doesn't work out? Say, what if it does work out? Um, you really got to think about that. Every time you catch yourself saying, what if something bad? Um, spin that around and say, what if something good? It, um, it's really something to uh, really embrace. Man, I'm guilty of it myself. Uh, you want to go take this opportunity, take advantage of this opportunity. You want to, I don't know, do something in your life. And you kind of get all excited about it. And then you start going, what if it doesn't work out? What if I can't afford it? What if um, people aren't going to like me? What if uh, I'm going to forget what I was going to say? What if um, I fail? Um, so stop, stop saying what if something wrong in your life. And start saying what if people do like me? What if uh, I remember everything I'm supposed to do? What if uh, I'm super successful? What if... Um, I walk into a big opportunity. Um, that positive mindset is really what we all need to put in our head. Uh, we find what we focus on. So uh, if we're focusing on what if something goes well, that's what we'll find. If we focus on what if something goes wrong, uh, that's what we'll find. So just where is your focus? Where is your focus? God gives you the ticket you need uh, to do what you need to do. If you look back at your life, you've gotten through every situation in your life. Every situation in your life has worked out. At the time, it may not have seemed that good. It may have seemed bad. It may have seemed like there was no hope. And here you are today. You got through it. Your odds are 100% that you're getting through situations in your life. So thinking about that, your mindset should be, what if it does work out? Because it's going to work out because God provides. So there's your message of the day. I'm going to jump on prayers over here. Look at this sunshine over here. Absolutely beautiful. Hempstead Lake State Park. We are on day 198 of 365. The journey is uh, on the downhill stretch. we still got to get through some cold winter months, but uh, mornings like these make it all worthwhile. All right. Name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. God, please uh, please help us to know that uh, you are there for us. Help us to know that you are there to provide. Help us to know that it will work out. And help us to believe in what if it will work out rather than what if it doesn't work out. Help us to stay positive and focused. And help us to keep giving to those around us. It's so super important to keep giving. Amen. Well, actually, let's add into there. Um, my buddy Steve's daughter, uh, Brianna, um, is going through some stuff right now. If I could ask out some prayers for that. Um, she, needs some, uh, she needs some prayers to help get through this. And then uh, my friend Kerry's uh, mom passed away suddenly. And uh, they're going through some tough times. And uh, some other people out there in the world are going through some things. My buddy Kevin just lost his mom. Uh, I got to go to two wakes today, uh, unfortunately. Um, so keep those people in your prayers. Um, it's always tough times, but we will get through it. We will get through it. Um, our success rate is 100% of getting through bad times. So keep that in mind. What if things work out? Because they will. God's there for you. All right, everyone. So happy Wednesday. Make sure you are having fun every day. Super important. Build fun. Build happiness. Build things that you like to do into your life every day. So you look forward to your life every day. Um, we talk about Wednesday's hump day over the hump. But you know what? There is no hump if you're enjoying every single day of your life. So make it a point to enjoy every single day of your life. Um, just think about that. You should want to wake up. Put something fun in every day so you look forward to each day. Each and every day. Don't wait for the weekend. Don't wait for hump day to start living your week. Uh, live every day. So, appreciate you all. Put your head on the pillow every night knowing you made the world a better place. Fire starts fire. Let's go. Go be an inspiration to someone in the world. The world needs more inspiration. God bless everyone. Have a great day.